All right, everybody, this is Shake and Bake from www.shakespub.net. I'm neck. <laughs> net. I'm back on homebrew vehicle sandbox, and I've got a new vehicle I built, a new plane. And, I've, and this doesn't look like much when you first see it, but a lot of work went into this um, plane. This is a World War II fighter, which I've called Tora Tora. Uh, it kind of has a Japanese World War II fighter look, plane look to it. Especially that bomb sitting underneath the middle there, which they've added. They've added bombs to the game. Well, this this type right here. It, after you drop the bomb, it recharges in 15 seconds. So you can drop them, which is really cool. I love it. Uh, they're going to be adding more bombs and bigger explosions at some point. Very cool. Uh, got my name plate on there, and you know my name plate over there. I got homebrew on the side. Uh, they've also updated the seat. The seat looks a lot better. I love it. And when you first look at this paint. Part of this is I normally I built vehicles with a gyro, gyro disc, gyro scope, whatever they're called, and this is my first vehicle, first plane without the gyro scope. I am pretty proud of that. It flies really well, and it really as you play this game more, it gets down to the tweaking, these minor tweaks to really make that vehicle um, respond the way you envisioned it. I did a little creative work here with the wheels to make it look like they fold up inside the wings, like they do with the World War II fighter planes. That's actually a parachute I stuck on there. Uh, and, and here's the thing I'm the most proud of. There wasn't enough thrust with one engine. So what I did is I actually stuck two engines exactly together so they matched up other than the blades right there, which is a little, little funny. Um, and so I get the the power of two engines and the look of one. I really like how Tora Tora turned out. And let's take it up in the skies, and uh, I'll show you what this thing can do here. Actually, this, let's spawn it this way. Now, an update on the 20 game keys. That has really, really taken off. As I'm making this video, we are at 3,030 keys uh, or entries for those keys. That's incredible. People obviously uh, want to win a, a game key to homebrew vehicle sandbox because uh, it is a lot of fun. I love to play this game. Um, my main reason is, is, you know, you had a hard day at work, whatever. It's just really relaxing to me. I love to get in here, build stuff, tweak it, you know, create things, just cruise around. It's a lot of fun. Uh, let's go ahead and drop this bomb here. I'll show you how this works. This plane handles so well. I'll put the file below. And if you want to download it, you can. You can um, try it out. All right, here we go. Coming in for a... Got machine guns on here. I love the machine guns. Firing off the wings. Let's try to get this... Uh, lighthouse over here, whatever it is. Let's see what we can do here. Oh! Just missed! Oh, I was just high. Um, the bombs are awesome. I'm glad they uh, they added those. It just adds another uh, a fun factor item. It just, it just takes the fun meter up. You get out there with your friends, uh, or just by yourself, you want to do some carpet bombing, whatever. I better pull up. Shoot, I'm looking back at the bomb here. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. Let me see if I can find a blimp. Okay, also some things they're working on. I do talk to the devs on occasion. Is they're working on the user interface, which is a, a good thing. Uh, it's probably especially in the building mode for some people. It'd be nice to see an undo button at some point. Um... Also, skins for the vehicles. I, I think they're working on that. Um, don't quote me, but I do think it's something on their to-do list. I'd love to see that happen, where you can actually skin these vehicles, uh, you know, build the ribs like I did, and then go in and skin them. I think that'd be really, really cool. Let's see if I can drop me a bomb right here. Oh, nice. Lots of fun. I think I'm going to update my B2 bomber and just uh, add a bunch of bombs and do some carpet bombing. Uh, I love this plane, um, not because it's got a bunch of stuff, to, just because it flies real nice and I like the look of it. Let's take it in for a landing, then we'll wrap this up. you still got a day and a half left for the competition to win a game key. Again, I've got 20 of them. Uh, enter it. You, you increase your odds by doing um, one or all of the four things that you'll see listed there uh, at Rafflecopter. So I do wish you guys all the best of luck. It is a great game. It is a lot of fun. Let's see if I can land this thing without killing myself. Oh, nice. Nice, nice, nice. 
not bad. Let's take one last look at Tor. Tor, I'll put the file below. If you want to check it out in homebrew, please do. I love this thing. I'm happy how that turned out. Okay, guys, I appreciate the subs, the likes, uh, the support. Cheers, peace, and I'll see you guys in the gaming world.